Hey everyone, this is Tim from Bike Minneapolis. I'm here today with Tom Zerbel, who is the defending champion of the 2012 Nature Valley Grand Prix. And we're in St. Paul today at the, uh, the St. Paul, this is not the road race, this is the, the, the criterium here. And um, Tom, what, you're preparing your jersey here. Thanks for your time today. But uh, what, what, how does it, how does it feel coming into this? You're the defending champion. You know, is this a lot of pressure on you, or, or what? It's a little bit. Um, definitely, uh, when you're wearing number one, uh, people expect you to perform well at the race as a defending champion. Um, but it's pretty comforting having such a strong team here. And uh, I know if I have a bad day, or you know don't put myself up there in a position to win. I have five other guys that'll pick me up and uh, I'll learn to step up, you know, in second. It's all about, uh, you know, the win on the last day. So. Yeah, so t talk to about that a little bit. Now, um, you know, I'm not super road racing guy, cycling and into that, you know, a lot of recreational riders that, readers that follow Bike Minneapolis and other stuff, but but there are lots of racers out there too. But how does how does the Grand Prix compare to the other races that you're doing, and and how does it all work? Can can you explain it? Um, well, this is a, a stage race, so um, they take uh, you know cumulative cumulative time over the five days, and so that's kind of the biggest prize, uh, the individual that has the lowest cumulative time over five days. But you know, there's uh, prizes for every day as well. So if you you know win a stage, that's a big uh, big deal for the team as well. But uh, Nature Valley is a super competitive race every year. Um, it brings uh, really good fields, and uh, it's a difficult one to win. Um, uh, especially, it's different in that uh, you know it's a it's a lot of crit criteriums, uh, shorter races, uh, spectator friendly. Uh, it just make, makes it more intense. Um, racing and uh, you know in six days we I think we race like 10 hours which isn't a lot but that just makes you know it means it's really intense and it's gonna be a hard 10 hours yeah you have to show up suit up and show up right yeah okay so um, oh and congrats by the way you just won a nationals time trial yeah thanks yeah, yeah that how's that feel that's I know great. I know you were really working and striving for that yeah, it's one of those uh, one of those career goals I've been knocking on the door for several years now, and to finally get it is yeah, it feels really good. It's it's a relief, but it's also a testament to uh, the support I have with this team. You know, Optum, uh, it's one of the best teams um, that I feel just up and down the support, the mechanics, just one years management. And, uh, it just makes our job a lot easier. And I want to just focus on putting pressure on the pedals and, and racing hard uh, makes makes things uh, much easier for us and just leads to more success. I would agree. I know, I know Optum is a uh, is a local team company. Yep, exactly. So a little more pressure because Optum is, you're on home territory. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Um, this is a big objective for the men and women uh, teams every year. And, you know, Optum is a, is a wonderful sponsor. And it's, you know, we're just psyched that they're behind us 100% and we want to pay them back, you know, and, and uh, have good results here and, and have good showing. So, yeah, it's a, you know, that's added pressure as well. But like I said, it's, it helps that we bring such a strong team here. Cool, cool. So now in, in researching, getting ready to talk with you today, um, I spent a little time online and uh, Googling your name and stuff. and. Of course, I came across uh, a lot of different stuff, a lot of the, the coverage from uh, Chattanooga where you won the time trial yeah. and uh, other races leading up to that. But I also ran across your own personal blog, and I think there was a post in there in March that you talked about you all of a sudden one day had a realization, hey, I've been road racing for 10 years. Yeah. Yay for me, cool. Talk a little bit about that. What's What's it meant to you and, and coming on board with Optum and the success you've had in the last year? Um, it was, you know, pretty overwhelming to have that realization that, you know, when I got into, when I bought that road bike 10 years ago, um, you know, I had no idea that it would lead to all the wonderful experiences I've had and 
to the people I've met and the places I've gone. So, yeah, I mean, it was, you just never know what, what life's going to bring. And, and I'm so thankful that, you know, the bike was brought into my world because, um, you know, I hadn't been exposed to that uh, previous to, to buying the bike and just the whole culture, um, not just road racing, but biking for fitness, biking for commuting, and, and you know, as a, mo a mode of trans transportation, it's just, you know, I've just been, like, opened up to all these things, how wonderful the bike is, and we work with a, a non-profit uh, that brings bicycles uh, to communities in Africa, where they, they don't race them, they, they use them for work, and they use them to get to school, and, you know, it's just this whole theme of how, you know, bikes can save the world, uh, in a sense. Uh, you know, I had no idea that existed 10 years ago. So, yeah, it was a big deal, you know. And, um, I'm just real, really thankful um, to have that, um, have that brought into my life. Well, I think it shows with the success you've been having. And stuff, yeah. so. so thank you for spending some time with me today. I appreciate it. And uh, we'll look for you on, uh, well, we're in St. Paul today here, but if we're going to be in Uptown and watching that section of the Criterium, I know I'll be there checking it out. So that'll be uh, a lot of fun. And so everyone uh, that's looking at Bike Minneapolis, you definitely want to head down to uh, Uptown on Friday afternoon where the men's and women's criterium will be happening for the Nature Valley Grand Prix. And Tom will be there, too, defending his title. Yep. Thanks again, Tom. Appreciate yeah, thank it. Thank you. I just want to say oh, quickly, sure. uh, that uh, we really appreciate the biking community here. We noticed uh, all the bike lanes. And uh, all the culture, um, I like the bicycles and uh, stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome, that's, one of the best in the country. that's great coming from you, man. I appreciate that. The whole city appreciates that. Awesome, thank you.